Hi everybody, my name is Bailey Renee. Um, this is my very first review on a product. As you can see, it's going to be on hair. I got sent some hair. I'm extremely excited about that. Um, the company is Glamour House of Hair. I've been following this hair company for so long now on Instagram. So afraid to try different uh, brands because you know, one brand said everybody thinks they didn't have the best hair or whatever, but I've been looking for something that was specifically my hair texture. And it's so hard because there's so many different brands. They think they have it right, but they don't exactly have it right. But I think I found the one. So um, it's Glamour House of Hair, like I was saying. And the hair texture that I picked was the Blowout. Uh, this hair is $140, what it says $139.99 per bundle. Yeah, well, it's worth it. I, I feel like it's worth it. Um, first of all, let me show you the hair that's already in my head. A tutorial on this, but I just threw it in just to show you guys how you put it in or what you can do with it. Um, I feel like I look like Diana Ross right now, what you think? What you think? Down the Ross. Yeah, honey. Yeah, honey. Yeah, honey. Yeah, hunty. What you think? <laughs> okay. Me three bundles. One was 20 inch, 18 inch, and 16 inch. That was more than enough. I don't know how they got all of that hair to fit in this little itty bitty little bit. It was like that hair could not breathe in this thing. I mean, but don't get me wrong. This is so cute. And purple's my favorite color. Now that you guys know that, purple's my favorite color. Y'all yeah. probably already know that because I'm always wearing this uh, sweatshirt. I'm always cold. I'm going to tell you the reason why I'm always wearing this is because I'm always cold. I'm always freezing. I am anemic and I'm skinny as I don't know what. So basically long story short, y'all got a problem with it? This is the texture. This is what I did to it. I put little clips at the end of the hair. I went to my stylist. Her name is Sonya. Hey, Sonya. Shout out to Sonya Durham. I went and got uh, her to measure the hair up against, she, she, she parted my hair, she measured the hair, she cut it, you know, just to make sure that when I put my clips in, it would fit exactly the way it was supposed to fit. So then I went home and put clips at the end of it, if you can see that, if you can see that. I put clips at the end of it and then... I clipped it into my hair. Now, let me tell you, when I first got the hair, like I said, it came in the purple bag, and then I went and I tested it. I have some pictures that I want to show you guys of it being submerged in water. I took some extremely ridiculously hot water and poured it on top of the hair just to make sure that the water didn't start bubbling up or that it didn't turn some weird white grayish color, you know, get really, really milky and thick. If your, if your water does that when you get your new hair, make sure you test your hair out, make sure you wash it. If your hair does that, um, that means it was chemically coated, which means more than likely from what I was told from a professional, that that means that it's not real human hair. Now, let me tell you, when I got this hair and I tested it in uh, the hot water, there was no bubbles there was no the water was still look like water it looked like you could still drink it so that was that test then i did the hot heat test um to see if the hair was straightened out it straightened out now what i didn't get a chance to do was to see if it would snap back i'm almost positive that this hair will snap back so what i'm gonna do in front of you guys is i'm gonna blow dry it. i mean not blow dry i'm gonna flat iron it blow dry it really I'm gonna flat iron it. Got my flat irons. Look at that. Wow.
bone straight. Look at that. Look at that. Now, I didn't go all the way to the top because I didn't want to burn my fingers, but look how straight that got. Like, <laughs> do I have to say anything else? Look at this. That, that is awesome. Now, what I want to do is I'm going to run, I'm going to put some water on this, I'm going to set it in front of the dryer, I'm going to blow dry it, and um, see if it'll snap back. Let's we're about to see. We're going to put it to the test. Be right back. Okay. I'm back. Now, I wet it. I wasn't able to put shampoo in it. Um, but it looks like it's starting to crinkle back up. I'm not sure if you can see that. Can you see that? Can you see that? It's starting to crinkle back up. I'm going to put it and sit it on top of this thing to let it dry. And then we're going to see. We're going to see if it's really about that life. We're going to see if it's really about that life. But, I mean, to me it looks like it's, it, it looks like it's waving back up. So, we're going to lay that right here. I put it in some water just to see if it will bounce back after I flat ironed it. Look. Check it out. It's back to its natural state. It's not all the way dry just yet. It's still really damp. But, um, yeah. It says on the website. Let me read to you what it says on the website. Okay. It says, blow out. It'll say in stock or out of stock beside it. It only has one customer review. I will be leaving a review uh, other than this video review I'm doing here. Um, it is $139.99 a bundle. Natural textured extensions made to mimic hair of African descent that has been blow dried straight from its natural kinky coily state. And that's exactly what I was looking for. Um, it, says, it says full cuticle layer aligned and intact. No chemical coating. Tested it for it. Came out good. It's reusable. Um, can be professionally colored, uh, machine wefted, sold in four ounce packs. Two packs needed for full head, possibly more if ordering 18 inch and above. Okay, so like I said, the inches that I ordered, she sent me three, and the inches that I ordered were the 20 inch, the 18 inch, and the 16 inch. And I didn't even, for all of this hair that I have on my hair right now, I think I use all of the 20 inch, of course, because I wanted that in the back and around the sides. And I know I use all of the 18 inch. And I had some of the 16 inch cut up, but I don't even think I needed to put it into my hair. So, I mean, and this is this is what I came out with. And I think it blended pretty well uh, for my hair, my own personal hair to be blown out. And all I did was just clip it in. And it, it just, I think, it, I think, it, I give it a thumbs up. Me personally, I love it. It looks just like my hair. The only problem I had with it is my hair naturally, it's a little bit darker than the 1B. She sent me a 1B. Um, I, not, I'm not exactly sure, but I think this is the darkest that this comes in. I'm not exactly sure what she said, um, but you know, other than that, it I, I love it. The texture is right on point. When I blow my hair out, this is what my hair looks like blown out, um, except the ends. Of course, the ends are a little bit more straight. Most girls who have natural hair, their hair does not straighten this well at the ends. Most of us, especially me, I'm four. I'm a four. Um, 4A, 4B with a little bit of 4C mixed all the way around my head. So my ends never come out looking like this. But I mean, I'm not complaining. I love it. I will be bringing you guys tutorials 
here on my YouTube showing you how to do different hairstyles with the clips. I might even be doing, I think I want to do a ponytail. I think that's what I'm going to do. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I have so many ideas now because I feel like there's so much stuff that I can do with this hair. Um, so I'm going to get creative just for my ladies who want to have a little bit of length or a little bit of volume, you know, add some dimension to your hair. I'm going to, I'm going to get y'all right. We're going to get our life. Okay. So yeah now this oh let me tell you about this hairstyle the hairstyle that i have in my hair now this isn't really a style i basically just did a quick um tutorial just to show what you could do with the hair um this video will be coming out next this will be out probably next week um i pretty much wanted to show a quick way of putting the clips in is is a nothing video basically how you can get the pieces measured to your hair measured to your the ends of your scalp you know where your parts are and you just put the clips on and then the you know just just throw them on in there but i just i wanted to do a little diana ross real quick something real quick and easy you know just to get y'all get y'all a little amped up get you a little just like <laughs> okay well anyway that's that's enough of that well I hope y'all enjoyed the tutorial. Well, the review. I'm sorry. It's not a tutorial. It's a review. I hope y'all enjoyed the review. Um, as much as I love doing a review. It's my very first one. I just thought about something. Are you guys happy for me? I hope y'all are just as happy for me as I'm happy for me. I'm proud of myself because this is the very first time that I'm actually talking to the camera. And I'm proud of myself. And I'm doing a great job. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a whole bunch of bloopers. But I think... Personally, I think I'm doing a good job. Let me know. Put a message down below. It's an awesome product. Um, it does exactly what it says it does. It's gonna do. It snapped right on back. It's obviously reusable. I did the hot water test on it. There was no bubbles in the hot water when I poured the hot water over the hair. There were no. Um, there was no milky residue inside of the water it didn't turn kind of whitish or kind of thick like uh, a lot of hair companies like i've been told a lot of hair companies hair does um yeah i, I feel like this is the real deal this is the real deal um go buy it <laughs>